Hello and welcome to my let's play of the demo of Stanley's Parable. Oh, Stanley Parable. No idea what this is like. I have not watched anything at all. So I'm trying it out right now. Not a single guess. I'm just doing the demo for now. If it's any good, I will go ahead and buy it. And if it's, I find it really enjoyable, or I get enough requests to do it. Okay, so here we go. It's loading. Loading some more. Loading, 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 loading. So yes, been interested in this game. Oh, I've had a request from some a person, uh, one of the subscribers, to do this, and I've considered to do it. And I just don't have the cash at the moment, so I went ahead and thought I'd start off with the trial, the Stanley Parable demonstration. Oh, oh, I've, I, what is this? Um. Hello? Hello? Can I get a drink? Okay, so... Stanley Parable demonstration this way. Okay. Uh, exit. That's nice. Door. Can I open the door? No. Can't open doors. What is this? Your number is 20... Welcome to the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Well, they just got no... Just a receptionist on lights. Number 28. Boxes. Thanks, invisible receptionist on the phone. Who does that? Who gets a receptionist via the phone? Oh, here we go. Oop. Door shut behind me. Do not stand on this fence. Waiting room. They're serving number 21. Let's wait here. Oh, I can crouch. I can sit on this chair. Oh, ooh, who, who spilled their... Someone spilled their coffee. Get clean here. Cleaner on aisle... No, just in warehouse 6. The outside world, the clock. So, Stanley Parable demo. Hmm. Two circles. I really wish I could jump. What if I go in there early? No, no, no. Here we go. Waiting for it. Here we go. Dum 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 dum. Ooh. Some famous demos. Building. Guns. Lines. There's TVs. Don't like it. Oh, hello, hello, okay. hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. Oh, I it will you. be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. Oh, I thank you. Just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Woo. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The looming uncertainty. Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 Come minutes or so? Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. Okay. Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. That's well, tell creepy. you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Yay. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility and what show the? how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. Oh, we're on an adventure. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Yeah, that's why I'm scared. This is just getting weird. This is the demo. Start off. I'm actually kind of wanting to see what this is. Ah, here is one such technology. 
These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press and we'll see what your choice says about you. How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? You see, our choices really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. Are they saying I'm a sexual predator? Scared. I think this game okay. can with What me. else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. Okay, um demos. Demo this device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. No danger, nothing in this room will kill you. I'm not so sure about that. Okay. Compliments. This is compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Ooh, Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. Whee, yeah. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. Wow. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no, you've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay then, what's next? I'm actually leaving the compliments room more depressed. This game has called me A, a sexual predator, and B, some insults. I'm not sure. Wall technology, this can't no, be I that bad. I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead, give it a shot. Oh, hmm, guess it's still in development. Right, okay, moving along. Oh, ah, uh, it's a troll. What is this? Is the anticipation still feeling it? Yeah, I, I, I'm starting to get scared. Emotional. Motion booth. Now here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, yeah. step into one of them and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Spare, we want to spare. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these annoying. comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to ah! But this discovery... It was though, and within, the shame he carried that... It sounds like the same as despair. Just, just, no. Now, now, we have to save at least a few emotions for the full game. Is that him? He's very bad. Oh, look, what I found a secret. 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 Oh, yeah! Disco! So, I'm starting to get confused with the whole point of Stanley Parable, but I'm enjoying the disco. Okay, time to go. 
moving on. That was amazing. That was a disco. And everything becomes better after having a disco. Okay, so on to. Ooh, you went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. What's down here? In solitation chamber. Weird. Now there's the... Can't read. And this is some art and a bucket. And let's go to the final choice. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. Whether it's conveyed the... No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. I'm scared. I'm not sure if this is a demo or just a full way of trolling anyone who wants to try out the game. I'm getting scared. I'm so scared. And okay. there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Oh, back here. However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you side agree effect? to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, mental, physical or otherwise, that may what? occur oh. while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Okay. Nothing? No objections? You're quite sure about that? Oh. Well, all right then. In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, so let's many. establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. Please perform a dance. Woo. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, Perform that dance, and I will terminate the demo immediately. Right. All preparations have been made. It is time the at last. Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? So this is the actual demonstration. But this is just very wide. Okay. Okay, onwards. Your number is... Oh, wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to Did the Stanley not? Parable Demonstration. Your number is 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you. And okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. I'm confused. Same green room. Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable demo take two. Finding the demo, Woo! learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. I'm sending another troll. Oh wait, the Stanley Parable. Oh wait, what's this? Eight. Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's this is all wrong. This isn't eight. the Stanley Parable. This eight. is a game where you press a button and it eight. says eight. Not only eight. is the Stanley Parable not eight. a game about continuously eight. pressing the number eight, eight. I can guarantee eight. that this button does not eight. appear anywhere in the main eight. game. Why is it here eight. instead of the demo for the Stanley eight. Parable? Eight. Where did the demo go? Eight. There was an actual eight. demo here before. Eight. Something has eight. gone wrong. It's eight. all gone horribly wrong. Eight. We need to get you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley eight. Parable based on whatever the hell this eight game is. We need to get eight. out and start amazing. over. Eight. You mustn't stay here another eight. minute. Out, out, eight. out. Go, go, go. Eight. Eight. I like pressing the button, eight. Eight. I think perhaps you've misunderstood me, so let me reiterate eight. as clearly as I can. This is not the oh, Stanley Parable. 
what you are doing is pushing a button over and over. Imagine if this had been the demo, what would you have been thinking? Oh, you would have left with no idea ever. what the Stanley Parable is about, none whatsoever. Okay, so now what? Um, now what? No? Let's go get... Yeah, I'm confused. Okay. Get. I prefer the number eight game. Oh, door shot. Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, demonstration. Your number is thirty. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration. Yes, I'm leaving quick. Out of here. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the eight game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. Oh, At this so time, powerful. please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, uh, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. Sorry. Uh. The worst troll ever. <laughs> I'm sorry. This game's a troll. Wonderful. I could really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. What? In this third attempt, we shall truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Let the demonstration begin. Rawr, bam, bam. Gonna kill this. over yet you didn't see anything everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the stanley parable is a quality experience worth your time and money it was here somewhere i'm sure of it oh no 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 we have to get out of here we have to find something for you to do anything the demo cannot end like this now ah, hurry hurry this way okay yes this is new this is different surely there must be a game somewhere in here okay oh. okay oh how about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. All right, now put it um, um, in the bin. Gonna put the cup in the bin, I'm feeling amazing. You did it, you won. You know what you get for winning? An achievement. Wow, the Stanley Parable just keeps getting better and better. Oh, in fact, let me take a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? You responded, What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. You really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. Oh, we're all beyond okay. that now, aren't we? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. Maybe a slight ending. Ending, ending, where are you? Where are you? Where is the ending? Is this it? Uh... Yes, Whoa. the end. Now, this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Ooh, I don't know. Uh, from that, I'm actually really wanting to go try out more. So be prepared, guys. I will be doing videos. This is just my sneak peek onto the future. Is it working? I, are you sure? You sure you pressed the button? What? what? No, we, we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. 
I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? Scared. We need to go back. We need to get out of here. Oh, not again. Okay. I'm not sure where this is going to end. Oh no, what's going on? Where is everyone? Okay, over to the left. Down this way. Whoa! It's the isolation chamber. Oh, nice and quiet, finally. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher, and I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be, but, but somehow I couldn't. I, uh, well, at any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Scared. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No, I think I've had enough of it. No more doors, no more demonstrations, Gosh. no more endings. That's the other problem with this game, there's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, oh but at the beginning of the demonstration, now oh, that was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going, no confusion, just a blank slate. I got this yes, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey, <laughs> do you remember, just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time, and I showed you the technology used to make the demo, because I thought there actually was a demo. <laughs> oh, we were so naive back then, how little we knew of the world. Um. And then, when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before, yes, yes. it's all so fresh in my what memory. They were such wonderful moments. <gasps> and then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere, and we just kept climbing and climbing, flight after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. And then we were in some kind of catwalk, I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? And we just kept going and we found that elevator and it said escape snit. And we talked about it for a while, about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but that it seemed worth a try. But at the very least it would be an adventure. So we got inside and we rode the elevator up and up and up. We had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when. And then after so long, it finally stopped. And we stepped out into the lush outdoors. The trees, the wildlife, the sun rising on a new and glorious path. No, I can't remember Freedom. any of this. We were free. There was nothing to think. Nothing to know. Scared. Scared. Being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? I remember this moment. Wasn't that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? No, it must have been impossible. It didn't happen. It did not happen. Ooh. Hello? Officers? Okay, I have just been hooked. That was probably one of the best demos I have ever tried. So, stay tuned folks, we will be doing the full edition of a Let's Play of Stanley's Parable. I just love that so much. Goodbye, and thank you for watching. And remember, we're doing paydays every Friday and Monday. Goodbye.